the needle is in here. That's the mixing needle. Then I'm gonna switch it. I twist, this is a smaller, smaller in size, not in number gauge. Thanks for clicking on Simply Tanika. I am Tanika. If you are new here, welcome. Hit that subscribe button. Let's hang out a while. If you are returning, welcome back. What's up, fertility fam? We gotta do what? Let's get those babies, ladies. Hey fam, it is Wednesday, the 31st of July. Can you see me? Happy hump day to you. Happy hump day to ya. Happy hump day. If you follow me on Instagram, well, first of all, if you're not following me on Instagram, what is up, girl? Um, anyway, if you follow me on Instagram, I have spent the day at the Botanical Garden hanging out. Um, we got stuck in a little bit of rain, although I feel like it's lightning now. Not that kind of lightning. It's less, it's lighter uh, than it was. So we might go soon but it rained a little bit at two. We're meant to go to a movie screen tonight. I'm not really feeling like it. I think I'm ready to get in the bathtub because it was super hot earlier. And um, we're gonna get a little rosé and then I'm gonna do my priming. I said a little rosé, don't judge. I have given up sugar and, um, well, except for whatever's in the rosé, but I've given up artificial sugar and dairy. So yeah. We're gonna do that, I think. And I just wanna take like an Epsom salt bath. We walked all the way here from Manhattan. We went to the Botanical Garden in the Bronx. We have a membership. Today's actually the last day. We have to renew it, but, so that was part of the reason for taking the day off. And it's the 31st. I think I've said it a million times. The beginning of the month is super crazy for me at work. So I thought this would be great. It's the last day of my membership. It's a great day out here and a nice like recharge before my life gets crazy yeah so i think bath some epsom salt some rosé and watch the debates hopefully you guys are watching too and figuring out who's going to represent you best yeah that's all i'm gonna say and your congress people your senators people in the house are they representing you are you in contact with them who's in charge of your district what do they think about health care? What do they think about your reproductive health care? For those of you who are saying you don't have any benefits, talk to your Congress people. Let them know that's important for you and that they should consider it for your state. Let your voices be heard. All right, that's all I wanted to say. I wasn't going to vlog today, but I've been chatting with a lot of you guys online. There's some BFPs I'm going to shout out um, when I get back and some other like good fun stuff going on. Yeah, day two of priming. It's going down.
can see me. Hopefully you can. I'm going to put, this is actually, I got this when I had my breast biopsy. It's the little freezer pack. I'm going to put that over here and I have to mix my alcohol, but I regret to inform you that there may be some plants that have died in the making of this video. I'm going to show you. Look, you guys. It's the aloe vera. I set it on the floor so I could close this to get better lighting. And the camera fell. I don't know if you guys can even see me or not. The camera fell. I feel bad. He's asleep. I'm going to tell him later. I think he's faking sleep because I was like, do you feel like you could give me my injection? Not so much. So I'm going to tell you, I'm going to mix these again, even though I had half a bottle from last night, I didn't bring my extra needles with me. Um, so I was like, oh, I could reuse the needle, but let's, let's not give ourselves infections. I think IVF 101. Um, oops. Damn it. It's all capped. But here I'm icing where I put the lidocaine. I'm gonna show you where I am. Um, yeah. My tummy is not flat. Come on. Yikes. Let's just get this going. This is the part. Ah. Here is our, this is the actual medication. The cetratide, the thing that is in the needle or in the syringe is um, the water. So I'm just gonna put this here, I'm gonna rub that there. And then when I get home, I will take the other mixture with me and I will, so here, I don't know if you guys can even see me, this light is not really good, sorry guys. The light is not, the lighting is not great. Let's see if I can get the camera light to come on for me. Okay, hopefully it helps. I'm not home, so I don't have like my ring light. Anyway, so here's the actual medicine. I'm gonna flip this off. I'm holding this because I'm trying to make it more numb. Um, I'm feeling horrible about the dead Arabelle aloe vera but I can use it for my hair so it's not like dead dead so see here are these oh I did it two needles this is the larger one that's the small uh, I'm gonna use the larger one because that's what you mix with first so it has a seal I'm breaking the seal put that on there twist it on here with the cetratide there's already the water is in there if you have Ganarelex, which is the same thing, it, it's already mixed, so you don't have to like do this part of it. Here's that lovely needle, which I used in my thumbnail for today's video. But anyway, so the water is in here. We're gonna stab at this. I've already, there's like a little indentation. I've already, as you saw, wiped it off with the alcohol. So that's all in there. I'm gonna mix it all up swirl it around again I'm gonna use half of this and if I were at home I wouldn't have remixed a new bottle I wouldn't have mixed a new bottle um, I just don't have any clean needles so I have to do this um, so that all the waters in there swish it around I'm just looking to make sure there's no like powdery residue because when you put it in there it's powder um, so that goes in all the way in and then I'm gonna pull it out actually because I don't like the angle that it's in. I've sterilized the whole thing so it's okay. Okay, here we go. That's better. Stir, stir, stir. I'm gonna pull out half of it. I think that's half, no, that's not. Okay. There we go. So that's there. I'll put this here. This I will use tomorrow. When I get home, I have um, a fresh set of needles. It is, what gauge is this? I can't tell. Tomorrow, I'll tell you what gauge it is. It's a smaller, no, 
the number is larger, the needle is smaller. That's how it works with the needle. So I am just, this is already in here. I'm gonna twist this completely off. Whoops. Let me show you. So it's all here with the entire thing on. I'm gonna twist it off so I take the whole needle off. So there you go. So there's nothing there. The needle is in here. That's the mixing needle. Then I'm gonna switch it. I twist, this is a smaller, smaller in size, not in number gauge. Twist that on. This is what I'm gonna inject myself with. I'm gonna take this off. It's nice and cool now. I also, the lidocaine has kicked in. Um, yeah. I'm gonna rub it down, smack it up, flip it, rub it down. Oh no, the girl is gonna do me. So we'll let that dry a little bit. While that's drying, I'm gonna take my, oh, this is not the right thing. I need to take my estradiol. This is my sedula, so I'll be right back. Ain't nobody don't pass me. I'm just so fresh, so fresh and so clean, clean. Okay. Hopefully I took this this morning because I've clearly mixed it up with my anti-anxiety medicine. But anyway, this is the estradiol, two milligrams. It's meant to be taken in the morning and the evening. Here's the evening one. Again, hopefully I took it this morning. Oh, it didn't go down. Okay, so twice a day with estradiol, which is estrogen, estrogen priming. This bad boy is ready. I'm all numb and ready to go. So let's just do it. Punch, poke. Ah! There we go. That is a subcutaneous shot, meaning it goes in our fat versus intramuscular, which is our HCG. But anyway, we'll do that one later. So that's that. Nothing is left in that vial. Put that back on. And I'm gonna take this Pineapple Band-Aid off. Put this Pineapple Band-Aid on. Do you need a Band-Aid? Do I need a Band-Aid? Well, do you need a Band-Aid? You don't. Do I? Yes. Makes me feel better. And they're so cute. It's like a little puffy one. So we'll put that on there. Mainly I do it not because obviously I'm not bleeding, um, but that way I remember which side I gave myself the injection, because clearly I can't even remember which meds I took in the morning. So why would I leave it to myself to remember which side I did it on? I know some people are like, you should remember. I don't, whatever. So that's it. Day two, which is also like a peace sign. What's up? So yeah, day two, priming, done. Estrogen, done. What do we do? <laughs> Two milligrams, twice a day, done. Cetratide, half of the dose of the cetratide because they're pre-measured in the evening, done. Day two, I'm estimating I'll do between six and seven days because my luteal phase is usually between 13 and 14 days and we started seven days into my luteal phase. So it's either gonna be plus seven or plus six to get us to 13 or 14. Does that make sense? All right, that's it. Thanks for hanging out with me today. I'm so excited. Oh, wait, I have to get the BFPs. Give me one second. First of all, not a BFP, but I just want to give her a shout out. Um, Cheryl Darling, who's getting ready to start her IVF. So sending you baby dust, so you got this. A shout out to Aisha J. 
Uh, who else do we have going on? Deidre, as always, what's up? I hope you and Vaughn had a good time at the beach today. I shared some of the photos um, with Deidre from where I was at the Botanical Gardens because she's not on Instagram. If you are on Instagram and you're not following me, what's up? Um, it's at simply.tanika. Check me out. I post a lot over there. Um, just fun stuff that doesn't really need to be in a video on YouTube. Oh my God, there's someone. Hang on, guys. I need to see... I gotta turn this on. Ah, hopefully that doesn't blow us up. Davis. I think it's Lashana. I think that's how you say it. Lashana Davis, 10 weeks pregnant, BFP. Congratulations. I think it's Lashana, L-A-S-E-A-N-A, -A -A, Davis, BFP. Congratulations. And I think... That was it. Who else do I want to shout out? Brody Salisbury. I have a really bad glare, you guys. I'll write it in below. But Brody Salisbury in her two-week wait, sending you lots of baby dusts. Um, hugs and kisses out to Latanya of Tanya and Aunt. I saw on Instagram that you got your that you got a BFN, and that always sucks. I'm sorry about that, sis. I think that is it. If I miss any of the BFPs, let me know down below, ladies. I always want to know where you are if you're in your two-week wait, if you got a BFP, if you got a BFN. I'm sending you my love. I know those always hurt. Um, if you're waiting to ovulate, let me know how that's going and tell me what tools you're using. Oh, and the last thing, you guys sent me a lot of notes about the pre-mama. So yes, I have a new phone. I've got an iPhone 10s Max, who knows what it is everything you can have in a phone. The gestures are different, but I did figure out when you do your test, you can delete them. Oh, let's see. Oh, it's going to tell me. And I'm, I'm not on Facebook anymore. If anyone's looking for me on Facebook, I'm not there. So find me everywhere else but there just because it's weird. Um, so normally in the old app, I could just go over here. Oh, there it's now it's doing for me. I tapped it. You have to tap and slide and then you can delete or amend same thing for the date and time because before i said you couldn't i couldn't change the date and time you if you tap and slide over here then you can change it and i believe how it works and you guys correct me if i'm wrong because i'm new as long as you put them in in the correct order you can change the date and time and it doesn't move in the best of worlds, you would be able to put them in in any order and then you change the date and time and it would put them in chronological order. I don't know. I haven't. Listen, I haven't tried that. It should work that way. It may not work that way. However, I did want to say that about the pre-mom. Pre-mama. Um, hopefully it's the last time I have to use any of these apps, but we'll see. So that does work. But if you, if you want to delete and you're on the 10, tap, slide, and then you'll be okay. It's weird because some of these, like on my phone, the gestures are just different. Um, let me see if I can go back. And I'm digressing, I know, guys. Sorry, I'm gonna wrap it up. But like here, and I go here. You see, on the old phone, you all of these would just slide. You have to be very like careful because if you just start like sliding stuff, there's no home button. So that gesture closes everything. Uh, and because there's no home button, a lot of it where you would just normally tap and do stuff, it doesn't do it. Anyway, that's another story. Can you guys see me? I'm gonna take it up now. Now that I've already killed the aloe vera plant, I feel so bad, but I do use aloe vera in my hair, so it won't, it hasn't died for no reason. It has died a noble cause. Anyway, when he wakes up, I gotta tell him that I killed parts of it though. Anyway, um, I don't remember what my point was, if I had a point. I am on day two. I remember that part. And I've injured an aloe vera plant that I'm gonna repurpose. I remember that. Cream Mama, I'm learning to use it with my phone. So far, I love the app. Um, any other point I was going to make probably doesn't matter now. Talk to you later. If you have any questions, comments, suggestions, leave them down below. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. It helps me out. And um, you guys are going to see this on Thursday. You'll see me tomorrow, but I uh, Friday. I 
my plan is to do the folate versus folic acid, the comparison on Friday. So you'll probably see that. And then I'll probably like combine the rest of my um, priming shots or some of them. So it'll be like day three, four, five, six, something like that. I'll combine them. Um, Cause I'm going back to work tomorrow. You guys don't want me to vlog from work. Like, meh, right? Um, all right, ladies, I love you. I can't wait to hear all of your updates. Oh, now I can't say it. M, M Jean Mama Love. Oh, I'm messing it up. She's in England. She got to be a fan. I'm going to put her name down below. I'm sending you my condolences, girl. I love your channel, love watching you, love your spirit and your little ones. Um, they sound so cute. I would love to see them more on camera, but I'm sending you baby dust. Oh, I'm sending you loads of baby dust. I'll talk to you all later. I love you, ladies. Bye. Mm -hmm. Baby dust to you all.